Hello, I'm IBX Toyka, and today I'm going to be talking about the Doctor Who skin pack, I'm going to be talking about pricing, going to be talking about release date, what's going to be in it, all that sort of stuff, all in one big video. So you might recall the Doctor Who skin pack was announced around about a month ago because of a partnership with the BBC, the people who make Doctor Who, if you're not aware, and uh, Minecraft uh, makers uh, 4J, and they basically had an agreement where they could make the skin pack, and they announced that it'd be coming very soon, showed us a whole bunch of uh, you know cool teasers, and then it just didn't happen very soon. We have heard nothing about it in the past month, but that's where today news comes in because they just announced a whole bunch of stuff all at once which is the best way to do skin packs because they're not that big a deal but it's still kind of cool for people who like Doctor Who uh, I'm kind of a Doctor Who fan but not as much as some people but yeah that's what's going on so let's talk about the release date so it's going to be releasing this Friday so that's Friday the 3rd of October if you want to buy the Doctor Who skin pack you can do it this Friday so that's awesome and it's going to cost you the same amount as the Marvel skin pack or the Avengers skin pack uh, those kind of higher prices than usual because they have to pay the licensing fee which is fair enough if you one or two sk skims, then I guess you have to pay for them. Um, and yeah, they have a lot of value adds because they have a lot of uh, kind of cool skins. And let's get straight into showing you those because um, there's a lot of Doctor Who skins. I don't recognize all of the characters, but I've uh, tried to recognize as many as I can. So here's the first screenshot. By the way, this is uh, just for Xbox 60 on Friday. I assume it's coming to Xbox One later and then eventually the PS3 and PS4. But that's what's going on. So uh, yeah, in this first screenshot, we see uh, some we Weeping Angels. I believe there's four in total. Uh, the there's two separate models from what we can tell. There's the one on the left and the one on the right. So two Two Weeping Angel models, uh, just if you want to scare your friends, and look at, uh, you know, the, the complexity of that one on the right is kind of cool, it's got like an almost cape on the back there, and that's nice. So, uh, this second screenshot shows us uh, the 11th Doctor, Matt Smith, I believe, or maybe that's his actor name, uh, and then her, his two companions, or his companion and her husband, uh, over on there on the right, so there's uh, this screenshot. It's also a cool, like, kind of TARDIS recreation from the inside, uh, that's always nice. So, this next screenshot shows off uh, the new Dalek Paradigm, I believe it's called. Uh, basically, it's five multicolored Daleks, which are all really, really, really cool to look at, because um, w the fact that you can play a Dalek, which, look at the model, by the way, like, they're entirely different than anything else, is cool enough by itself, and, uh, you know, it's even cooler when you know that you, you can just be the massive Dalek thing and you can be them in so many different colours and we'll come back to more of that later. So this uh, next screenshot shows us, uh, I believe it's the 4th and 6th Doctors from what I can tell, as well as 4 companions uh, from over the time. Uh, again, they're from classic uh, Doctor Who, so it's not some, they're like from the 50s, but yeah, old companions, old Doctor. So if you're a big Doctor Who fan, you like the classic episodes from, uh, you know, the black and white era, the really old era, then you get 4 companions from them, which is something uh, I couldn't say I'd ever expect. So so this next screenshot shows the latest Doctor, uh, Peter Capaldi, or I guess they're all just the Doctor. So yeah, uh, P Peter Capaldi and his uh, companion, I believe it's Clara, and they're inside the newer TARDIS, the new fancy one. Uh, so that's always cool. This next uh, screenshot, Doctor Who Skins Volume 1. By the way, they all have different branding on them, like some say Doctor Who, some say Doctor Who Skins Volume 1, but whatever. So uh, this one shows uh, four weird monsters I can't recognise, as well as, again, uh, Matt Smith, the 11th Doctor, and uh, the companion, and the companion's husband. So this next Next screenshot is the Dalek thing all over again, but even cooler. So if you didn't like just the multicolored Daleks, you can play as them in black, silver, uh, gold, red, or bronze for some reason. So more new Dalek paradigm, um, which is always... It's going to be interesting to see just how many Daleks there are. Uh, I think most people who buy this skin pack will probably be for Daleks or for the latest Doctor. Uh, I can't really see any other reason, but that's just uh, me personally. And then finally, this last screenshot, there is uh, like a whole bunch of screenshots for some reason. Um, and it's the 11th Doctor, uh, Liz. Um, I think that's one of his older companions and then it's also got the Smilers from a uh, season 5 episode uh, but yeah the Smilers in the corner there you can see how kind of scary they are as well as uh, the Alamp Doctor and Liz so that's what's going on there a whole I, that might be even all of the skins that they've got in there um, that's like uh, 20 plus skins uh, or maybe that's the trial but yeah most of the skins announced just today which and in really really cool situations I really liked all of the uh, like kind of effort they put into most of these and uh, yeah that's what's going to be happening so if you want to buy the skin pack it's going to cost you around about three dollars two pounds that kind of region and you can buy it this friday so friday the third of october mark that date down and there'll be a doctor who skins volume two coming out at some point in the future like they did marvel um having like the multiple skin packs and it'll also be coming to the other consoles at some point in the future um as far as i can tell that's how it looks like i don't see why they'd make it just the 360 version besides sales but you know it's hard to say right now so i hope you enjoyed the video like it if you did like it share it if you really liked it if you're not too bothered let me know because i I like to keep knowing what's going on there and uh, check out Let's Play Monday if you missed it because yeah.